What's good out there everyone? Roll Easy here back with another GTA 5 online money glitch video and this one is 100% solo, alright? 100% solo working on Xbox One and PS4 at the moment. Uh, not sure about PC once again. Sorry guys, can't even play, you know, like I said before, can't even play GTA 5 on my PC right now. Kind of sucks, but hopefully I'll get that fixed soon. But uh, yeah, this glitch, this is the solo deluxo dupe glitch, okay? So yeah, it's not the highest paying, but it's still working and it's still solo, but there is a different place to actually breach, okay? So if you guys have watched my video before when I did this glitch, I actually breached at a different point and it seems like they have tried to patch up that breach. You can still get through it with the deluxo, but it is much more difficult. So in this video, I'll show you a way better pr a place to actually breach with the deluxo that does not have a death barrier whatsoever you don't have to worry about that at all okay so a uh, big shout out to the founder digital junkie and we're gonna get going with what you need to actually do this glitch so first of all obviously you need a deluxo no friends it's solo and you want to make sure that that deluxo is an either an original bought one that can be duped or it's a modded one that you maybe made with SP to MP or something like that and you brought in those will sell for the same price those will sell for you know 300k max as well but for those of you that have been given a deluxo gift cards to friends anything like that you cannot dupe the dupes so you need to make sure you have an original deluxo either purchased or made through SP MP okay so apart from that you also need a nightclub doesn't really matter what garages you have you just need RH8s so order up a bunch of free LG RH8s RH into your nightclub okay so you're gonna need that also the MOC with the personal vehicle storage and it can be empty or not doesn't really matter but that's where we're actually going to be saving the dupe okay so those are pretty much that's pretty much everything we need to be honest with you so uh let's go ahead and actually get started with the video here so this is me right now i'm actually outside of my nightclub and i'm gonna go inside to uh proceed with the beginning of the glitch so i don't believe it really matters which you know garage level you actually have i've probably done this glitch in garage level two and three and it seems to work perfectly fine so if you want to copy that you're more than welcome to but at this point once you're in the garage just grab any one of these old rh8s and you know and drive them out so i'm gonna grab this one if you want to remember the plate go ahead 22 qxn that will actually be the plate that's going to turn or that's going to be merged onto the deluxo dupe that we're going to have later okay so you go ahead and just kind of put that in your memory bank now once we have driven that rh8 out all i have to do is drive it out get out of the car go grab a street car and you want to drive as far away as possible to where you can request a new vehicle okay without having to return that one so i usually drive around up to this point you guys have seen me in the previous video uh, i drive to this point i go ahead and i get out and this is where i can actually go ahead and call up my mechanic and order up the deluxo that i'm going to be duping so this is that deluxo part you want to grab the deluxo that is either originally bought or made through spmp because if you're not you won't be able to actually sell the dupes okay so this glitch is pointless if you have a dupe deluxo and you're duping that you don't you do not want to dupe a dupe okay you always want to be duping the original so at this point if you're doing this glitch multiple times always grab this same deluxo okay so i have a few but i know that this one right here is the original right here that i bought so i'm gonna go ahead and grab it and get in and this is where we're gonna head over to that breach okay you want to head over to this breach i'm gonna show you on the map right now and it's it's actually a little bit closer to the airport to me it's a bit more convenient but this is where the breach is it's pretty much in this location right here uh, i'm just going to go ahead and skip forward to where i'm there i'll show you on the map once again right before i actually enter the breach but this is kind of where you want to approach the breach itself it's basically right on top of that garage all right this is the exact location right here super close to the airport the airport's literally right you know below us to the south so you want to back up around to the fence line and go ahead and start hovering and you want to go at a decent speed and you want to aim right at the top corner basically right up in there you see i missed it uh don't worry about missing it guys it happens okay we all do it but right here you're gonna see after this second fail attempt i will hit it right here it's pretty simple so go at a decent speed and you want to aim right for this little crevice all right so go straight into it boom there you go 
You don't have to worry about death barriers, nothing, okay? At this point, you want to go ahead and turn around, and then you just want to go under the map and stay hovering at this point. There's, you see how the uh, the kind of those little glider wings on the side uh, turned in. What that means is that now we're actually hovering on this little invisible plane uh, right under us. So you can just simply do this. You don't have to go up or down or anything. You will stay at this level right under the map, and you want to take the same route that I'm taking. Uh, at this at this area, you don't want to worry about or you won't really be worrying about tunnels because I don't think there's any actually here But you're heading towards this exact spot on the map now This might take you a few tries to find the exact spot. It's okay I'm gonna show you a fail and then I'm gonna show you, you know an, a good attempt But this is pretty much the area that you are in if you look at the shape I mean, it's kind of like a uh, you know a morph square kind of if you look on the mini map but this is the little kind of pocket that you want to be in all over by the runway I'm gonna open up my map and show you the exact location but you need to make yourself level and then you need to just go ahead and drop now I'm actually gonna uh, just end up on top of the map as you can see right here see that I ended up right on top of the map that means I missed it we this is where the nightclub interior is so you should be aiming for the the nightclub interior if you're falling and you're just falling right through the map this isn't the glitch isn't patched it means you miss okay you miss the nightclub uh, you know that's under the map right there so all you have to do is head back over to this point which is really easy because it's super close to the actual airfield so you head back over to this wall breach no worries no worries about death barriers and you make your way back over to that same spot okay on that invisible plane going back over there just make sure you don't touch the water obviously on the right side where you see that water starting to come in if you touch that you will end up underwater and your deluxo will eventually be destroyed but on this attempt right here you will see me successfully hit it what i realized is you need to be a little bit farther away from the airfield on the left it's kind of hard to explain but on the mini map so this is the area right here that i'm in all right i'm in this little this little enclosed area on the mini map now as you can see there's airfield to my left all right that's going straight you need to you need to be a little bit more farther away from that more towards the middle okay and as you can see on the map i'll show you the exact spot this is exactly where you actually want to drop all right boom right here you see that this is where you want to drop i'm going to go ahead and just take off the hover mode by pressing x or a and then you should boom spawn right or land right there in the nightclub right now wait for the mini map okay look at the mini map right now you see the mini map boom dark you want to go ahead and tap right trigger or rt okay just tap the gas you can hold it i hold it for a couple seconds and then let go you should spawn here drive forward a little bit and boom you saw that the plate actually did change plate changes right before your eyes you get the plate that was on the rh8 remember i said the plate was like 22 qn something that's the plate right there that was on the rh8 so this is a brand new dupe all right now we need to go ahead and save it so the method to save it easiest thing to do is go ahead and call up your moc that must have the personal vehicle storage and once you have that out on the map you want to fly this over there and just drive it in doesn't really matter if you have a car in there if there's a car in there it will just transfer it to where the rh8 was because remember the game technically thinks this is an rh8 right now because they just merged it doesn't be or it doesn't stay a deluxo the way it looks until you save it so drive up to the moc press your id pad doesn't matter if it's full like i said and then you want to go ahead and save the vehicle and that's it guys all right that is the solo deluxo dupe very very simple very easy to do if i wanted to rinse and repeat i would just go back over to the nightclub pull out an rh8 and drive away in a streetcar and call this deluxo out and repeat the whole process over again but you can make a decent amount of money with this and you know i know not everybody has friends out there to actually help them with glitches so this glitch right here is very very beneficial to all of those that just want to sign on to gta and just get some money solo all right uh, the nightclub itself i've thought about making some extra videos on it it is pretty cool how i'm getting 70k you know every couple of days just by going over to my safe and you know they're making me money what i don't like is the fact that i'm gonna have to buy all the businesses like the mc businesses to be able to have them you know working for me in the nightclub but i think full price man that thing should sell for like you know six million dollars and all the goods once you have that fully maxed out and you have all the storage levels but yeah you can make some pretty decent money over there with the nightclub but uh yeah like i said i might be making a future video on that i might not be uh, depends on what money glitches are coming out we got red dead coming out very soon as well in a few months i have been meaning to pre-order it make sure you pre-order if you plan on pre-ordering it make sure you do it soon because if you do it before the 15th then you will actually get that treasure map in red dead redemption 2 and 
$2 million in the bank in GTA. So for those of you wondering when you should pre-order, if you plan on pre-ordering it, just do it now. All right, do it now and you can get, you know, some free money in GTA right now to play with as well as the treasure map to play with over there when we get Red Dead Redemption 2 upon release. All right, not sure what the treasure map is going to lead to, obviously some form of treasure, but we have no clue of knowing exactly what it is. All right. So that's going to be it for me, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, solo Deluxo dupe. Get going. Get hidden this. Use that new location. No worries about death barriers. And I've showed you the exact spot to actually hit that nightclub. Could be a pain sometimes, but the setup is real easy to redo again. Uh, make sure if you're brand new to the channel, you hit that big red subscribe button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.